Happening here, it's the first full day of fall, and the Roger Williams Zoo is already preparing to carve hundreds of pumpkins for this year's Jack O' Lantern Spectacular. TJ Del Santo headed to the zoo for a sneak peek at this year's event. We are about two weeks away from this year's Jack O' Lantern Spectacular at Roger Williams Park Zoo, and this year's theme will take you back in time. <laughs> This will be the 22nd year for the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular and the 10th time here at the zoo. It is bigger and better than, it, than it's ever been. Preparations are underway, mainly setting up the staging around the wetlands and among the witch hazel. In between building staging, we have to draw and paint all the intricate pumpkins. There are 150 to 200 of those pumpkins which can take 10 to 15 hours to make. Three miles of speaker wire and three miles of Christmas lights will be strung. Then in about a week or so, the actual carving will begin. Lots of carving. On display uh, through the month, we'll have well over 10,000. That's over 10,000 pumpkins, 5,000 of which will be on display at a time. <laughs> Speaking of time, that's what the theme is, a look back in time. It's going to be a journey through history, basically, starting with dinosaurs uh, and working its way through different eras from the Renaissance to democracy to the Wild West. The display will then be broken down into each decade from 1900 to the present. And then uh, it's brought to life with different musical scores from pop or from uh, whatever captures that moment in time. <laughs> We're not boo scary or, or horror or any of that stuff. I think that's uh, what people like about it most. It's very family friendly, no blood and guts, no gore, just gourds, just pumpkins. You know? <laughs> the Jack O' Lantern Spectacular begins on October 7th and runs right through October 31st. I'm TJ Del Santo for The Road Show.